exactly what the winds are doing from Balloon Fiesta Park here in just a second, but the clouds are pushing their way in and a storm on its way too. Let's show you what's going on and we start with that look outside and the clouds have definitely increased across the area here. As we put this into motion, you'll see clouds moving their way on through, but the storm system itself is still a ways away from working its way into New Mexico. In fact, this thing is still back over California and because of that, we're not going to see our best chance for showers until a bit later on into tomorrow. Here's a look at what's going on with satellite and radar. We do have some showers out there right now, mainly in east central sections out to the west. And we talked about this yesterday that we might have a little moisture hole in central New Mexico. And that's what's happened to us this afternoon. Haven't seen a whole lot of showers right here along the valley floor, but coming up into tomorrow, we'll get that shot at getting some more showers and maybe even a sprinkle or two overnight. Winter weather advisory for the San Juans of southwestern Colorado for tomorrow, for today eight inches of snow around places like Wolf Creek and outside the Durango Mountain Resort as well. Here's a look at what's going on with the current conditions in the metro area. In fact, right here at the studio, we're at 74 degrees. Southeast winds at five miles an hour along the Fiesta floor. Well, we've got winds around eight miles an hour, so it's a little gusty out there for your perfect glow, but hopefully we'll be able to work this in because tomorrow's going to be a tough day. 60s and 70s across the north right now, 60s, 70s, and some 80s across southeastern New Mexico. Here's the storm we're concerned with. It's right here over Southern California. As it comes ashore, what it's going to do is it's going to push a cold front into the area as well. That's going to touch off some showers, and then the storm itself will lift through the four corners and out of here later on in the day tomorrow. So here is your storm bus potential. It's right over Southern California right now. As far as the timing goes, basically now we're already seeing some showers through early Saturday morning. Rain out to the west with mountain snow, especially in the San Juans, but some in the Sangre de Cristo Mountains as well. Thunderstorms out to the east and valley showers here with some gusty winds. Bus potential is down to 45 percent. I do think we're going to get a little bit of rain tomorrow, but I don't think this is going to be a soaking kind of storm, which really going to be a big time game changer, but we will at least get a shot at some showers. And the way we're going to get that shot is as this thing closes in, we'll get the cold front in. It'll push some showers into central sections along with gusty winds tomorrow. So tomorrow at Bloom Fiesta Park is not going to be necessarily a great day, not only because we have the rain, but because of that wind. The good news Saturday, Sunday, things quiet down and the weather gets much much better. So let's break down exactly what's going on with the moisture here. You can see the front lining up tomorrow morning across the western portion of the state and it will advance into central sections as well. And again, out ahead of the front, it's going to be windy. We're going to get a shot at some showers through the morning hours and early afternoon hours here in the metro. This is noon tomorrow, and that's where that best shot is here in central sections. And then you see things just sort of lift off to the north by later on in the day tomorrow, and then things clear out. The big question for Saturday morning at Bloom Fiesta Park, will we calm the winds down enough so that things are better by the time we hit Saturday morning? And that's going to be right on the edge. Do more on that as we get closer. 56 Pagosa Springs, 58 in Durango. Look for snow in the San Juans above about nine or 10,000 feet. 60 in Gallup tomorrow, 63 Grant, 64 in Farmington. Good chance at at least scattered showers at the very least. Southwest temperatures here, 60s, 70s and 80s. Partly cloudy skies with those showers as well. Quiet for the weekend over to the southeast. Mostly cloudy here with showers 87. Carlsbad 84 in Roswell and 64 in Cloudcroft off to the northeast. Temperatures for the most part 60s and 70s. Showers, yeah, we're going to get the wind tomorrow here as well. Watch the northern mountains. If we're going to get some snow tomorrow in the northern mountains, I think it's going to be later on in the day, about this time tomorrow, we could see a changeover at resort level. Again, that's above 9,000 feet too. So anywhere where you're really traveling in a car, no major issues on that front would be just mainly rain showers. 69 to Harris, 70 in Estancia, and finally right here in the metro area, temperatures mainly in the mid 70s with scattered showers, especially in the first half of the day tomorrow and gusty winds, and then things get better. Saturday into Sunday with temperatures warm. Much cooler though by Saturday. Yep, no doubt going to feel like fall again. All right. Thank you.